Living in a place as beautiful as Idaho, it is easy to see how artists can be inspired to create. And now there's a place they can do exactly that, all while sharing their works of art with Boise's West Side. Hi, I'm Deb Barger, and I'm the owner of Art Zone 208. So Deb, what is Art Zone 208? Well, it's a cooperative. We have 42 members. It's a space where artists can display their art. Yeah, and there's quite a collection here. I mean, there's all kinds of art. We are a very diverse gallery. We have everything from oil, watercolors, ceramics, uh, mosaics, wood carving, fiber art. Wow, so lots of different artists with lots of different skill sets. Yes, Coming into absolutely. the space and being displayed. Mm -hmm. And there's even an association, if you will, or some kind of connection with Boise State. Yes, we have two artists actually. John Kilmaster, who is a very prolific artist. People are very fortunate to have him here locally to take classes from. That's exciting. Yes. And then there's also an opportunity for people to participate in a project here associated with another Boise State professor. Yes, we have um, Dr. Lewis Peck. His daughter is selling his artwork here, and they have just started a legacy project for him so that he will not be forgot. So, All right, yeah. so it's to continue his legacy on. Yes, yes. That's exciting. Yes. Okay, but there's a chance for viewers to also come and take advantage of other classes as well, right? Absolutely. We have beading classes, we have painting classes, all sorts of classes. I'm noticing a lot of artists are pulling from the beauty of the area and uh, it's kind of a celebration of home a little bit too, right? Yeah, absolutely, yes, yeah. yes. We welcome people to check out our Facebook pages. That's where we okay. We hit post our classes. Okay, so. so the information is on social, on yes, Facebook. Yes, yes. We're starting our sixth year in a few few months. So. All right. And so now everybody has a home. Yes. Wonderful. Yes. Deb, thank you. You're so welcome.